I'm sure you're tired of talking about America's Got Talent. Let's do it. When you see a fellow comedian on TV, there's a part of you that doesn't want them to succeed. Sure. But someone's made to win America's Got Talent. Yeah. Well, you got a story. They want your mom in there too, right? So they're like this this like line producer's like, oh, we're gonna get your mom in there. She's gonna say, I'm proud of you. And I'm like, this is not gonna work. My mom is an immigrant from Bangladesh, right? But I, I face up my mom. And I say, hey, mom, can you say, like, I love you? I do it. And then the producer's like, listen, um, can you do that again? But this time, like, your mom believe it. They didn't use that at all. And I know a story before, like, last year before, Fumi, who didn't get on because he wasn't Japanese enough. He told and us, yeah. there was a guy who just bowed lower. Yeah. And I was scared. I was like, I will become the browniest brown. I will come in singing Arabian Nights. I'll come in in a purple vest and no shirt underneath. You, you rolled an R <laughs> while saying your name, even though there's no <laughs> yes. R in there. I wore a turban on a tur I wore two turbans. Dude, I came in hard. I came in brown.